I'm Helena Norberg Hodge, director of the international nonprofit Local Futures. We put together this event to celebrate the emerging worldwide localization movement and to strengthen it by encouraging more international collaboration. Hello from London. I'm Tandy Newton, and I'm wishing you a happy World Localization Day. Happy Localization Day. Happy World Localization Day. We live in communities and we must help each other in communities. Therefore, can we not live in touch with nature if we don't localize our economy? And I'm thrilled to be with you today on World Localization Day. Be accountable to our bioregions, and that that would be the most meaningful thing we could do. Local is our future. We're not separate from the cosmos. We're not separate from nature. We need a new political story. We like to think of the transition movement as being a movement of communities who are reimagining and rebuilding the world, and they do so with a particular focus uh, on localization. Who benefits from globalization? Who benefits from centralization? Obviously, an elite cadre of powerful institutions and organizations. I've been thinking a lot about the GDP and how it has changed us potentially. Do we measure what we value or do we value what we measure? Sabemos que el metabolismo de la economía globalizada is irreconciliable con la finitud del sistema biofísico. It is critical that we start to move ourselves into alignment with Mother Nature. Big supermarkets are now gradually crowding out, squeezing out the small family farms, squeezing out the small family businesses. And one by one, the high streets are becoming dead as this trend goes on and on. Globalized work, globalized struggle. This is our slogan within La Via Cambacina, a global peace and movement that struggles for food sovereignty, that struggles for land rights, that struggles for peace and rights, that struggles for building local economies and building local food systems. One of the really dramatic consequences of the coronavirus pandemic is the rise all over the world of community-based mutual support groups. At the same time, there's a growth in response to the longer term crisis of neoliberal capitalism, which has been devastating for 40 years. I think a lot of people are starting to realize that just giving responsibility to a few corporations for everything has left us all very vulnerable. Ma sempre più persone iniziano a comprendere che la soluzione nella localizzazione della produzione dei servizi per ritornare ad un'economia non soltanto più umana, ma che sia capace anche di una maggiore redistribuzione della ricchezza prodotta, evitando che confluisca nelle mani di poche persone. For anyone who thinks that a new world will be born top down, they don't get it. Life grows from the bottom up, and localization is where the new world will be created. Mm -hmm.